God, Zooks, another tuition hike. When will it end? Maybe when they start growing teachers on trees. Hey, that's not a bad idea. Growing teacher trees? No, providing the administrative services ourselves. I mean, we've seen hundreds of seminars. It'd be a cinch. Totally, we could use uh, one of the rooms in the old arts building. Nice. Let's not lose any time on this. We'll talk about it later at your place. Okay, see ya. Hey, dude, come in. Can we discuss what we were talking about earlier then? Yeah, yeah. Let's work it out big time wise. I really want to waste no time on this. Yeah. We better get on it right away. We're just gonna take this out and then we'll put uh, Mainframe system? In the, in the what if we map this address to the configuration? And then the deactivate the subsystems yes. through the mapping? Yeah. I think you're not typing this. So. Welcome to Guerrilla Education. I see a lot of new faces today, and you should all be very proud of yourselves for coming out. As you may know, Guerrilla Education is about deinstitutionalizing information, and we're, we're taking back what is rightfully ours. There are risks involved of which you have all undoubtedly been made aware, but despite these risks, there are great rewards. You are participating in a revolution, and you should all consider yourselves heroes. One day, we will all be able to grow up and watch our children grow up in a world where no doors will be closed on them. With that in mind, let's begin. Open up your handouts. County. We're going we're gonna to talk about nouns today. Nouns can be divided into three categories. There's the subject, the object, which can be further divided into direct and indirect, and the noun phrase as subject complement and noun phrase as an object complement. Now, let's take the, su the sentence the fat, ugly puppy ate the dog. 